I want to go down the hole. <laughs> Hello, friends. My name is Brandon Data, and I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Omega Strike. I was sitting here just uh, jamming out to the music in this town a little bit. Really like the music in this game. Didn't really notice it in the first level, but um, it's got kind of a spaghetti western feel to it in this town, which I like. I like quite heartily. We're headed into the eastern mountains today to try and find some helicopter parts, so we might be able to, to fly that helicopter around. Or they're probably not going to let me fly it. But that guy will fly it for me. It'll be like the most badass chauffeur ever. He'll be like, where would you like to go today, master? And I'd say, once, once around the park, Winfred. That's his name, Winfred. I know he had a, another name before he knew me, but this is his new name now. Oh, kind of the same tile set in this cave. I hope that's not uh, going to be a, a sign of things to come. I want to see some new and interesting lands. Don't you understand? I was able to get rid of that that grenade fella relatively easy. And uh, my health is low, so thank God for the health drops. Quite helpful. Ooh, what's that thing? It explodes. <laughs> There's a bunch of stuff up here. There was a bunch of stuff down there, too. Which way am I supposed to go? Alright. I'll go over this way real quick. I just want to see. I must sate my curiosity. Ah, see? 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 Life cubes. Life cubes! I need these so I can get more, uh, more little squares of life or whatever. Whatever one might call it. Welcome to Cloud Top Mountain! Oh, thank you so much. What a pleasure to be here. I can see the clouds from the top of this mountain. Is that perhaps where the name was derived from? Hmm? Uh, yeah. <laughs> You'd have to be a genius to figure that out. Oh, but I am a genius. Not as good as Dr. Finkel and Einhorn. Or Dr. Omega. Who I think is better than Dr. Uh, Einhorn. Because he was able to invent a, a teleporter that kicked the shit out of Einhorn's teleporter. What's up with that, bro? I thought we were like, you know, the best. No, we're not. We're just the resistance. The resistance! But you can't stand against true power, can you? Maha! I mean, we're gonna try. That's all we can do is try at this point. There was uh, probably another little section under there. But I'm trying to move forward. Oh my god. Gotta be careful. Gotta watch my butt. Wash my butt? I think I said watch. I mean, both are true. <laughs> Gotta wash my butt. Everybody remember to wash your butt. It's very important. You don't want to get like a diaper rash or something like that, do ya? 30 year old man with a diaper rash? That's just pathetic. <laughs> I don't much approve. Having a little trouble shooting these heads. It's kind of nice of the uh, grenade guys though. I'm able to shoot them from under without getting hit, and then uh, the head blows up also. I wish you could juggle it a little bit, you know? Get some like extra combo points or something like that. There's a sign that says there's poison. There's poison at the bottom of this cliff. Please don't go uh, jump in the poison. There we go. Get rid of those boxes. Boxes of doom. I'm feeling a bit more confident today. We died in the, uh, the, the last level, or the first level, I guess you'd call it. Oh god. There's mines. All right, I'll just uh, have to destroy it, right? Yeah, it doesn't even hurt me. Yeah, I'm very ashamed that I died to the first boss in the game. But it happens from time to time. We can't all be perfect. We're just humans. We're all just humans, bro. Don't go down there, there's poison. I guess all I was supposed to get from over there was uh, a little bit of extra gold. I take it. Whatever. Please, please no shoot. Please no shoot. I just human. I human. I eat foods like human. I make excrete like human. All right. Should I go back towards the, the beginning here? Is this the beginning? I guess not. It all looks different. Different, but the same. Oh God. Very uh, generous of them to give me a bit of invincibility though. Like, oh, you took the hit? That's cool. I don't 
necessarily know if I'd need that. Then again, yeah, you kind of do, because those old school SNES or even NES games, mostly NES games, I would say, that don't feature invincibility after a hit, like, you'll die. You'll die extremely quickly. Even Cuphead features invincibility. I appreciate that a lot. I don't know if these two series are going to be, like, congruous in the same weeks. I'm not sure how long either series is going to last. I can stop pressing the fire button now. I've just gotten so used to it. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I can't help but compare the difficulties to two games that I'm playing at the same time. Especially if they're uh, run and gun shoot 'em ups like this, you know. I'm not obviously not going to compare Skyrim to anything I'm anything else I'm playing currently, because that's the only RPG at the moment that I'm playing. But I've got big plans in the future. Oh yes the not-too-distant future. I've been saying Skyrim's gonna gonna be over for, for just a minute now. But I want to end it right. I gotta make everything perfect. Unlike uh, all the other series on my channels. <laughs> That'd be so nice if I could just uh, not screw something up for once. I don't hold my breath for it, though. What do you mean, Dayton? You don't screw up that often. I died to the first boss in this game. Okay. Unacceptable. Thought I was gonna need a double jump to get across there. Everything turned out okay. Dodge, dodge. This is why I'm the best. Oh god. The grenade got me. It comes down through the platforms. How unfortunate. That's alright. I still shot that guy in the head. Or rather, I shot his body. But then I shot his head. Oh god. You don't die from the spikes? <laughs> that was a question I had in the last episode as well. I knew we'd find out eventually what the case was. Oh god. And then I jumped into his fucking bullet. It's not good. It, that's not good. Please don't. All right. We're totally gonna do better. We're going to do better this time around. Every day I wake up and I try to do better than the day before it. And sometimes I succeed. Sometimes. <laughs> hmm. Should have got that range upgrade. Oh no, I could hit it from here. Awesome! Everything is cool! Alright, no mines up here. Please and thank you. Jump! Oh! I'm gonna get this guy from down below. Those grenade guys are a-holes if you try to take them, take them straight on. Oh god. Ow. <laughs> I should have just taken the time to blow them up, but uh, I didn't want to. I didn't want to! Now I've got one little box of health left. Four hits left in me before I drop dead. But that's pretty generous, you know? Lots of other games are like, oh, one, two hits, you're dead. Especially uh, the ones that are trying to be hardcore, you know? Those hardcore games! I'm not going to say Cuphead again, but that's what I'm thinking of at this very moment. Kill that guy. Yeah, they are uh, distinctly different games, but both extremely enjoyable. I talk an awful lot about, um, you know, if Cuphead's too difficult, then there is another game out there for you. And this might be the game that I'm talking about. You want a little run and gun action? Here you go! It's not exceedingly difficult. You're not gonna s fucking break your keyboard or whatever keyboard. Who would play run and gun platformer with keyboard? Ha! <laughs> Whatever's dude. I uh, I don't know. A lot of people have different preferences. I'm not gonna, gonna spit on somebody's preference. But I will say that my preference for platformers is a uh, is a controller. Some people play shooters with a controller which I, mmm, I don't fucking get. Oh, good. We found a boss. Rassler. Finally, I found you! Not very nice of you making me chase you all over this damn mountain. I hear you made short work of dozer. No matter. You're no match for me. Well, I'll try. I'll try and be a good match for you. Like, uh, on Match.com or something like that. You want a Tinder date? I mean, you, you're bigger than most of the people that I, uh, am attracted to. But I'll give you a chance. Maybe, uh, I'll find you interesting or something like that. And then we could we could be friends forever. Yeah, these bosses seem to only have Oh god! 
I take it all back. <laughs> I was gonna say, they only seem to have like two or three attacks. But uh, they've changed everything up now. He's going down. Don't worry about that. Ain't gonna die to another boss. Fuck you! Not gonna happen. Hell yeah. New ability gained! Combat roll while controlling Sarge, press special. Oh, I thought Sarge's special was just that he was the leader, but he actually does get uh, a combat roll. So that's gonna be pretty nice. Now we can get into all these little confined spaces and whatnot that I've seen before and was like, huh, I can't crawl, I don't know what to do. Well, guess what? This is what you do now. Ooh, life cube! Delicious life cube! Oh god. So lucky I avoided that. <laughs> I halfway remembered something for once. Excellent work! We are the victors! The victors! I think it's supposed to be We Are the Champion. But if your name is Victor, then that would be a good song for you. <laughs> Hello, my name is Victor! So lovely to meet you, Sarge! Comrade? <clears throat> Alright. Get a little save going. Roll back through here. Oh, I guess I'm going back a different way than I came. Hmm. Uh-oh. Don't go over there. Or maybe do. But not when there's a fucking mutant waiting for you. Hmm. This looks kind of familiar. Maybe I do want to go down the hole. I want to go down the hole! Let me down the holey! Oh, this is all familiar too, I think. Boop, 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 boop. Now we're just doing it for funsies, aren't we? Uh, if I jump down that hole, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get back up. You shouldn't go off the, the path. Usually the game game designers are like, Here, here's a, a specific way for you to get back to the, the beginning or where you need to go easily. But you know, sometimes you just got to blaze your own path. Blaze a trail, bro. Yeah, this is definitely where I was before. Oh well. I'll go back through that door. Although maybe there's some... neato spaces that I could combat roll into. Hmm. Didn't think about that. Oh well, whatever. I got a mission. I'm trying to fix a helicopter. Ow. Didn't mean to do it. Didn't mean to do it! What a mistake. It's fine. Maybe I could also afford that range upgrade for the gun. That would be really nice. And if not, then... I'm not scared to sit here and farm some coins off screen. I want all my guns to be fucking upgraded, man. They gotta be the best. How can we be a, an elite unit of rebel operatives if we don't have the best weapons? Shit ain't gonna happen. Everybody knows that. That's basic. That's fucking basic. And I've definitely been here too. Is there another uh, little section that I can combat roll into? That is what I am presuming, but I don't recall it. Then again, I didn't uh, make a mental note, as I thought we were just going to meet a fourth character or something like that. Oh god. Now we're back, back here again? I should have gone back the other way. Fart! Fart and shit! And also some poop, too, as well. Hmm. Oh well, we'll just wander around for a little bit. Everything's fine. Collect some more golds. Lose some more life. But, uh, health drops are relatively plenty on this, on this game, so... Yeah, I'm not too worried. Not too worried about nothing. Look, here's where you beat the boss. Remember that? Good times. <laughs> yeah, it happened like a couple minutes ago. That was, that was really recent. Alright, here we go. Not fucking around with any of this stuff. Oh, that's why I got a life cube. Hup! Hup! Oh god. This time I forgot the spikes were down there. And again. I'll just say that I didn't forget. I meant to do that. You know, like a cat or something. That fucking falls on his head and he's like, eh. I knew what I'm doing. Don't talk to me. I'm too good. I'm too good to be talked to. Also, can I hang out with you? <laughs> Could we hang out together? 
Yeah, sure. You're an asshole, but you're my asshole. And I take good care of my asshole. Like I said, wipe it, bleach it, stick it in a stew. No, wait, not the last one. Aww. Uh, I want to get across here. Alright, do it. Do it, do it. I knew I was going to take a hit, but... Sometimes that's just how it go. If I had the double jump character, I probably could have avoided that. But that's all right. We ain't we ain't got him back yet. He's been stolen away. Just a little extra help. Mmm, numbers. Numbers, yummers. All right. Here's a, a secret hole we can go through. And I probably uh, don't need to go up this way, right? I can't recall. That's the problem with things looking samey. We need like a monument or some shit. Then I can know where I've been. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Oops. There's another skull. They're like, here you go. Go buy an upgrade. Thank you. I will consider it. I want this coin. <laughs> greedy. What a greedy peedy. Hmm. Surely there is another place to roll into. Yes. Yay, verily. I think there's spikes down there. But you never can tell. Oh! I gotcha. I gotcha! Don't try to run away from the Sarge! Alright, go here. Boom, boom. Alright, everything's going awesome! Still need to find some helicopter parts, though. I assume I have to roll into the space that has them. What's down there? Something shiny. Shiny med kit. Will keep me from die. At least, uh, that's the theory. I might just die anyways. You never do know. Oh, I should go down here. Go to the space that you couldn't go into before without, uh, the roll. Yeah, that's right. Is it just a shortcut? Hmm. A little bit lost already. This is the, the Metroidvania part. Hmm, <laughs> there's a space to roll. Let's do it. Let's roll in there. Excellent. Now this is definitely uncovered ground because there's no, like, alternative entrance to this, this part. So good. Give me some helicopter parts. We can get the fuck out of here. Taking me just a minute to find them, eh? There they are! Spare parts. Wonderfully done! And now, uh, if I want to keep the timing of this episode correct, we need to get the fuck out of here relatively quickly. No more wandering, okay? Just go to the left. Everything's gonna be fine. Bo bo bo. Heh, can't handle me. Can't handle me, suckers. Should I have jumped up there? Or can I just go to the left? I think it's fine. I think everything's going great. Let's fucking merc this thing. Oh, oh! Doing pretty good. Pretty good, Sarge. I'm liking that a lot. Don't just take the blind leap, though. How about over here? Let's go over here now. Oh god. What, what was I trying to do there? <laughs> Brain, what were you trying to do? Wall jump. There's no wall jumping in this game. There's no wall jumping in any game we've played recently. I don't know where you're coming from with that shit. I just wanted to try it. Okay, then. Great. I'm glad you uh, are so free to experiment with our lives. Oh, the, the game savey thing also heals me up. So that's nice. I was hoping that chicken didn't expire before I got to it. Because that's always sad, you know? Happens in Project Zomboid a lot. <laughs> All this chicken, I need to get the chicken. Hey, chicken man. All right, one at a time. And go. Oops, I took the hit. I took another hit. How could this happen? That's not good. All right, we're doing fine. We're relatively healthy. I know this is the way back. And here we are, the beginning. This is where we started. Everything is cyclical in life, don't you see? 
You'll always come back to where you came from or something. Come back to where you came from. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. God damn it. Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! I'm just a man with with some helicopter pots. Trying to give them back to this other guy that wanted some helicopter pots. Get some coins. Bet we could buy some upgrades and shit. Hell yeah! What's up, bruh? You found the parts! Awesome! I'll have this bird up and running in no time. Sweet! Tink, tink, tink! Done! <laughs> that should do it. Thanks for finding those parts for me. Come talk to me when you're ready to head out. I might be shortly, but first I want to uh, check for some upgrades. Extra firepower, etc, etc. Yeah! Oh, can get a range upgrade? Uh-huh. And I can't quite afford emergency beacon or rifle damage upgrade, so I will buy emergency beacon. Dang, my brain is uh, spacey. Really spacey lately. Kevin Spacey, if you will. All right, let's let's check out where we can go. Need a ride? Emerald Woods, Blackstone Mines. Hmm. I mean, I assume that it's all in order, you know, the way you're supposed to go. So let's check out the Emerald Woods first. Oh, this environment reminds me of Time Crisis. It's just it's just some woods, Dayton. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Just like Time Crisis. Other games have wood in it, Dayton. It does? <laughs> Reminds me of also uh, Mickey and Minnie's like magical quest or whatever it is. Oh god, what a reference. What a reference! My goodness. I just want to explore the Emerald Woods. I want to find my friends. I can't shoot down at those things. I guess I need a bomb or something. Who knows? Who knows? Who cares? Whatever, man. And there's a guy with a chainsaw. That could be fun. What you got there, buddy? A chainsaw, huh? Let me take that off your hands. That's dangerous, okay? You gotta be careful with stuff like that. And here's a, a tunnel entrance of some kind. We'll get it in the next episode, friends. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Omega Strike. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. And we'll see you in the next one. We'll explore uh, whatever's beyond this door. What's beyond the door? Oh, it's a military base. We'll explore the military base in the next episode. Oh my god, I spawned this guy again. <laughs> I'm such a spaz. Anyways, thanks so much once more. I will see you in the next one, friends. This has been Omega Strike from your friend, your humble narrator, the Brandon Dayton, the Dayton does, the, the, the guy that was talking this whole time. Anyways, <laughs> see you in the next one. Until then, friends. Bye-bye. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.